I want to thank everybody. Um, you know, because of COVID-19, everything is different now. In a perfect world, we would be outside right now. Uh, it would be packed with people, and we'd be able to really uh, uh, cherish this moment. But that's okay. We could do that next year. So what we're going to do today is it's a smaller type of ceremony, uh, practicing, you know, social distancing and the like. But it's my honor and a privilege to be here today. And thank you. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you for everybody for being here. On behalf of the city of Brockton, I welcome you. I always welcome you. This office might have my name on it, but it's an open door. If you need me for anything, you come and see me. That's how we, how we operate. But I want to read a proclamation. Uh, we're going to do a, a ceremony today. I want to thank uh, Mike Simmons from Brockton Community Access. I want to thank uh, everybody that works for City Hall today, Brian Matta, that was able to work uh, and do it inside, uh, and my team today, uh, and my employees that work here in the office. Uh, I do want to read a proclamation. Uh, whereas Angola was liberated from Portuguese rule in 1975 in an act that demonstrated the resolute spirit that has characterized the Angolan culture through the ages, and whereas the growth and prosperity of Brockton, Massachusetts is due in part to an ethnic diversity that includes the Angolan population, and whereas the city of Brockton has been greatly enriched by the introduction of Angolan customs, food, and culture, which was brought to us by wonderful Angolan immigrants who have made an indelible mark on the city of champions, the city of Brockton, Massachusetts. And whereas it is an honor to recognize the accomplishments and contributions of our citizens of Angolan ancestry and to extend to them best wishes for continued success and prosperity here in the city, the Commonwealth, and in the country. Therefore, I, Robert F. Sullivan, Mayor of the city of Brockton, hereby pro proclaim November 13th, 2020, in the city of Brockton as Angolan Independence Day, and I urge all citizens in the city of Champions, the city of Brockton, to please join me in observing this fine, wonderful day. Signed this day, 13th day of November, 2020, by myself, Robert F. Sullivan, Mayor of the city of Brockton. I would like to present this uh, to Pastor Neath uh, at this time. And if anybody uh, would like to say a few comments, please. Pastor. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you. I would like to call the president of the situation. Thank you, Mayor. Thank you, Mayor Robert Sullivan. Thank you, City of Brockton. So it's an honor to, to receive this award. We are Angola community, we are a small community in Brockton. I've been living here for 20 years, but we participate in community, we try to help each other. Recently, because COVID-19, the Angolan Association, we've been giving people masks, we've been giving people hand sanitizer. We do a Zoom meeting once a month, you know, so we can communicate with the Angolan community, so we're trying to do our part. So Brockton uh, and the U.S. always been, you know, a home for us. Like I say, I've been living here for 20 years. I'm also on a business. So this, current, this country is, is doing good for us. So I'd like to thank everybody, and I'd like to thank Mayor Robert Sullivan. We, I also want to say that we have a small gift for, for, for you, Mayor, from the Angola community. We'll present this to you. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'll read it. Yeah. Oh, I'll read it. Thank you. Oh my gosh, this is a wonderful gift. Nice gesture. <laughs> Let me just show it for the TV audience right here. Thank you. This is generous. And leadership. A true leader has the confidence to stand alone, the courage to make tough decisions, and the compassion to listen to the needs of others. He does not set out to be a leader, but becomes one by the quality of his actions and the integrity of his intent in the end. Leaders are much like the eagles. They don't flock, you find them one at a time. Presented to Robert F. Sullivan, Mayor of the City of Brockton by the Angolan Association of New England, this 13th day of November, 2020. Oh, thank you so much. What an honor. Thank you, thank you. Let's get a picture of this. Thank you very much, this is beautiful. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. Uh, I also want to say that uh, I've been the president for the Angola Association 
for the last two terms. So it's been like four years. And uh, recently we had election. And I would like to present the president-elect. So he's going to take uh, leadership tomorrow, but just because we have the ceremony today, so in the future he'll be the president of Angola Association. Mr. Delano Kiame. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you, thank you. On behalf of Angolan community, I'd like to introduce myself to you, Mayor. We've been pleased about your leadership in the city in the midst of the kind of uh, difficulties, but you've shown your best. You. We are very pleased about the work you're doing in, in, on behalf of our community. So we are very pleased to work with you. I've explained myself to you. I have your number, your contact. Anything I need, I'll reach out to you. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much for everything you're doing for our city. Thank you. To my Angolan community, vamos ter tempo de trabalhar e teremos a oportunidade de conversar. É uma nova era. Agradeço ao presidente Jorge pelo tempo que ele fez. Agora é uma nova era. Prometo estar perto, ouvir muito, falar pouco e trabalhar mais. Muito obrigado. Thank you very much. Thank Just you. a few words for tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is generous. Thank you very much. Yes. Appreciate this. This was very kind. Thank you. I'm going to hang it up in my office right now. Thank you. God bless you.